Mr. Chairman, Excellencies, Distinguished Delegates, on behalf of Secretary General Hu Lin Zhao, ITU congratulates you on your election and thanks you for giving us the opportunity to address the 75th session of the Second Committee. Over the past months, the COVID pandemic has demonstrated the vital importance of meaningful internet connectivity to people's livelihoods, employment, health, and well being, education, and social participation. Those of us living in a tiny handful of privileged countries are in the habit of speaking of the digital world as if ready, affordable access to the internet were the norm for most people. The harsh reality is that half the world has never ever connected. That means 3.6 billion people excluded from the vast store of information and opportunity that those of us online take for granted every day. Many of the unconnected live in least developed countries or in rural and remote areas. Typically, they are the most vulnerable members of society, people living in poverty, minorities, displaced persons, persons with disabilities, indigenous and marginalized groups, women, and of course, children. The COVID crisis has served as a wake up call to the global community to rapidly re-energize efforts to connect the unconnected. Eliminating global inequalities will only become a reality when all people across the world have equal access to digital information and digital products and services and are equally empowered with the skills needed to succeed in the digital economy. Leaving no one behind will mean leaving no one offline. Ladies and gentlemen, by highlighting the critical importance of connectivity, the global health emergency has opened a window of opportunity for action. We may never again benefit from the intense focus governments are now according to ICTs. The UN Secretary General has explicitly recognized the power of digital technologies as an enabler and as an equalizer. And ITU has been greatly encouraged to see digital front and center in so many of this year's debates, particularly during the high level week of the UN General Assembly. Over the past 10 years, our work with global leaders, including heads of UN agencies, heads of government and top CEOs, through the Broadband Commission for Sustainable Development, has advocated for broadband networks to be prioritized as a basic national infrastructure, as vital for growth and development as networks like roads, energy, and water. The Commission's new manifesto, issued on the eve of this year's UN General Assembly debate, calls on leaders to prioritize connectivity as fundamental to sustainable development and global recovery. The manifesto affirms the commitment of the Commission to mobilize efforts to achieve the global goal of universal connectivity in support of the UN Secretary General's Roadmap for Digital Cooperation. ITU's Connecting Humanity report estimates over $400 billion will be needed to connect those still unconnected. The UN Secretary General's roadmap comes at a time when the need to cooperate on digital development has never been so crucial. ITU looks forward to engaging very proactively with you, not just to build back better, but to build back better with broadband. Thank you.